everybody and welcome back to the Blossom Crochet channel. First of all, if this is your first time visiting, then hello and my name is Rebecca and do make sure that you subscribe to the channel so that you can keep up to date with all of my videos. So this one is just a little extra video because I've not had a chance to film a tutorial this week, but I ordered something as a little Christmas present from me to me. So I've treated myself, which I don't often do, but I wanted to show you what I've got. So you can probably see, obviously, on the box it says furls here in the corner, so that is where my order is from. And I've literally not, not looked at these yet, so you're going to see them just as I see them for the first time. Oh, that really worked well, didn't it? <laughs> so I've never ordered furls hooks before, I've never even used one. But there's something that I've wanted to try for a little while. Just because obviously I see people talking about them and I follow them on Instagram and they do look really pretty. And then I noticed that they had released some galaxy themed hooks and I'm obsessed with space so I thought I'd treat myself to some new hooks. So they're all the Streamline Swirl range, but I've got three different colours and three different sizes. So I'm just going to go straight in with the smallest one, which is the 4mm. So I'll do this 4mm one first. And this is the, the most plain one, I think, that I've chosen. And it's basically just the Streamline Swirl in Cream. And as I say, this is a four millimeter. Let me just zoom in a little bit. Okay, so this is the four millimeter cream one. I'm just hoping that it's showing up well on the camera. But it's all really shimmery and glittery. Well, not glittery, but it's not quite that big, <laughs> the, the speckles, but it's really, really shimmery, so I'm really hoping that that's showing up on the camera, but it's very beautiful. So that is the 4mm. We'll do the 5mm now, which again is the Streamline Swirl, but this one is called Taurus. So these are the more spacey, galaxy themed ones. Wow, so you're seeing these for the first time just as I am. So this is the 5mm. And I'm just going to do a really slow turn. Again, they're really shimmery. But you've got that beautiful marble colours running through, those galaxy colours, which are absolutely beautiful. I'm just doing the slow turn in the hope that it's going to show up really well on the camera. So I think I think you can see how lovely and shimmery they are. And those colours are really nice. So again this is the 5mm and this is the colourway called Taurus. So I'm really looking forward to using these. They feel like they're going to be really nice to work with and to hold and hopefully I'll be able to use them in some upcoming tutorials as well which would be really nice. So yeah. Loving the Taurus. And then finally, we've got a 6mm. And this one is called Andromeda. So I'm really hoping it's really nice. Wow. So this is Andromeda. And like I say, this is a 6mm. And I'm loving the colours in this. Again, it's very shimmery. I love these shades together. So I'm really like, I think my favourite is Taurus, but that's, the Taurus was the one that originally drew me in when I saw it online. And it is just as beautiful in real life as I was hoping it was going to be. So these are my three new beautiful furls hooks. They were £22 each, so like I say, that is why I'm classing them as a Christmas present from me to me because it's obviously more than I would normally spend on hooks or anything like that 
but I really wanted to treat myself and get something that was really different to anything that I had before. I will of course leave a link in the description to the website and I will write down again just what they all were, the colourways and things in case one of them in particular has caught your eye. So there we go, that is my first set of Furls hooks and if you've got Furls hooks let me know what you think of them in the description, which ones you like because there's so many different varieties and shapes and handles and things so if you already have some do let me know what you've got as well and I will see you for a normal tutorial really soon. Bye for now.